Now, there's a kid in Greeley, Wesley Martin, who's only 10 years old, and this summer he needs brain surgery that his family can't afford. Well, something needs to be done, and the Colorado Eagles stepped up and are trying to get it done. 7 News reporter Lindsay Sablon and photojournalist Major King have the story. That's him, a Russian tortoise. Wesley Martin is like any 10-year-old boy. But we have to watch him because he'll dig away. He likes his turtle Rex. And then here's my Monster Energy bed. He loves anything related to Monster Energy dirt bike racing, and he's begging his parents to be on the football team. So what's your favorite team? Um, the New York Giants. You're a Giants fan? Why are you a Giants fan? I don't know. I just don't like the Broncos. <laughs> In his short life, he's learned the value of living. Yeah. Well, when Wesley was seven months old, we found out through an incidental CT scan that he had a, a arachnoid cyst on the right side of his brain. At that time, Wesley didn't need surgery. This is all of his medical records. But as the cyst grew, the diagnosis went from nausea and headaches to permanent neurological damage, even death. Every time we, we do have a CT scan, we always hope for the best. In July, this MRI crushed their hope. The cyst, the light gray area, is now collapsing the right ventricle. When we found out, it was devastating, very devastating to us. That's when Wesley's parents found Dr. Shahinian with the Skull Based Institute in California. He's been featured on the show The Doctors, performing the surgery Wesley needs. They would just go right in through his eyebrow and make a very small incision. This video shows the same surgery Wesley needs by the summer, the entry point different. We sat him down at the table. You know, he wanted to know, will I be disabled? Are you scared at all? No. How come? Just not. Well, good, because I am. <laughs> Finding the doctor was only half the battle. His insurance won't cover the cost because it's out of network. His family's only option, pay $200,000 cash up front. At first I thought we should just sell our house and empty our bank account and move to California, but... After a family talk, they decided to try fundraising, but they aren't doing it alone. Ladies and gentlemen. March 8th, the Colorado Eagles will put on their jerseys for Wesley. We need to find a way to help this young man out in any manner that we can. So playing this game on March 8th is just going to add a drop to the bucket. That night, dubbed Pot of Gold, started around St. Patrick's Day three years ago. The idea was to be part of the community. These one-of-a-kind jerseys will be auctioned off. The money from that and a portion of pre-ticket sales will go to Wesley's fund. They have been really incredible. They have been so good to us. With all the fundraisers, there's a few simple but perfect words Wesley wants you to hear. I just want to say thanks if you guys help. And the Eagles' actions are not lost on this family whose only hope is their son can live a normal life. There's just no way that we can ever tell everybody thanks. Yeah. It's just amazing. It's pretty incredible. This sport known for its toughness on the ice touching families off the ice. Thanks. In Larimer County, Lindsay Sablon, 7 News. Uh, great story, guys. The Pot of Gold game, March 8th. Buy your tickets in advance if you want to go. A portion of ticket sales will go to Wesley. You can also go to the 7 News app for more information.